Hello, I'm Dieter Döpfer of Döpfer Musik Electronic Germany. Greetings to all modular users all over the world. I hope you all are well and in good health. So far, we had no problems here at our company. We all are well and uh, had no health problems. I wanted uh, to tell you a little bit about our activities and plans uh, during the last time and uh, in the future. One positive aspect for us here in our company was that we had the chance to calm down a bit and uh, to finish some projects we were working on. For example, all the modules which were shown at uh, the NEM in January are now available for the customers. The new joystick module A174-4. This is the module most customers are waiting for from our point of view. Essentially it's uh, a joystick with uh, X and Y positions, but it has also uh, a third voltage with, which is um, generated by the rotation of the knob. So this is why we call it a 3D joystick, because you have three parameters which can be controlled by the lever. It has uh, the usual outputs for X and Y, positive and negative, and you are able to add an offset voltage to each output. For example, you have the X offset, you can add or subtract a DC voltage to the output. This is valid for all the uh, three outputs. <laughs> In addition, uh, the module features a gate output, which is triggered by a small button on top of, of the lever. And uh, we have so-called quadrant outputs. The four quadrant outputs uh, tell you in which quadrant you are with the lever. This tells you you are in Q1, in Q2, Q3 and Q4. And you see that even the LEDs of the other quadrants light up a little bit. This is controlled by a parameter we call overlap. If overlap is zero, uh, there is no over overlapping between the quadrants. So you see here you are in Q1, Q2, Q3, Q4. If you increase the overlap parameter a bit, you will see uh, if you move from one quadrant to the others, there is some overlapping. Without overlapping, it's like that. And with more overlapping, it's like that. So you see the overlap function. The module is uh, available in the vintage version, which uh, you see here, but it's also available as in the uh, standard version for the customers who prefer uh, the standard version. Another module um, which is available now is the A138. It's an octal linear VCA. You have eight linear VCAs. For each VCA you have a CV input, an audio input and an audio output. And in addition, the module features uh, three mixers. The first mixer output mixes the signals of the VCAs one to four. The other mixes the outputs five to eight. And the, the center mix output is the sum of all outputs. A very useful but simple module which can be used also uh, in many applications together with the joystick if you want to control the levels of audio signals or control watch signals by the joystick CV outputs. Another uh, very important module is uh, the voltage controlled stereo mixer module 135.3. Essentially, it's a four channel mixer, but for stereo signals. That means you have two inputs. You have left and right audio input for each channel and one control that controls the level of both signals simultaneously. You have um, left output, right output, and in addition, the module features also CV 
uh, control for the levels and each uh, CV input is equipped with an attenuator. It's uh, our first stereo module and I will tell you later a little bit more about stereo modules. We also have now available the dual voltage control polarizer A1332. A polarizer is uh, a very special VCA which does not have only positive amplification but also negative amplification. And negative amplification means that the signal is inverted. For each of the two units you have a manual control. So let me connect the bus that you can see also the LED functions. You have a manual control that tells you uh, if the VCA uh, has a positive amplification, if the LED is yellow. At the center position it's zero and if you go left from the center the LED becomes red which tells that the amplifi amplification is negative, that means the signal is inverted. In addition um, you have a CV input where you can control the polarization by an external uh, CV voltage. The module is dual, that means you have two of these polarizers. Based on uh, our experience with the polyphonic modules, uh, we decided to design also some stereo modules, especially stereo filters or stereo VCAs or stereo mixers. Uh, we will discuss uh, with uh, our users uh, in the near future which of the functions are really required and necessary and which can be omitted. Yeah, this is uh, one of our plans uh, for the near future. Okay, so uh, thank you for uh, watching and for listening. Stay safe. Bye-bye.